gentlemen, my name is Thomas Pickler, welcome to Unimoose TV. I'm going to be taking you through all sorts of things regarding the summer university out here in Kazan, Russia. Now first up we have a very, very special guest, Samantha Mills, winner of the first gold medal for the Australian team. Actually it was the first gold medal that was handed out at the university. Congratulations, Samantha. Yeah. We have got a gold medal. Show the viewers back home what it looks like. There you go. It's actually got a really nifty feature. You're going to have to show that off as well. Here we go. Oh, God. Don't break it now. Don't break it now. Oh, you can yeah. smell it. There we go. Very nice. It's a spinning metal. Yeah. It looks great. It's super duper heavy, and I'm sure the whole family at home is looking forward to getting their hands on it. Oh, yeah. Now, I'm going to have to ask the cliche question. Everyone does it. How do you feel after picking up the gold medal? Pretty excited. I guess I can't stop smiling. Everyone keeps asking me like, "How do you feel? Congratulations!" And like, I just can't stop smiling. Um, I'm so happy for myself. <laughs> well, it's been a great Sorry. achievement, and you know, you should be really proud of yourself. Um, what were your expectations leading into the competition? I guess uh, what were you feeling like when you came in? Um, I guess pretty nervous. It's a final, and like, any like, I knew the field was pretty open. Anything could happen, really. Um. I guess you had the Russian and the two Chinese girls, and I thought the Russian would probably, you know, take a medal because it's hometown. But yeah, I knew if I could nail my, like, my hardest dive, I'm like, I knew I had a good chance of being up there. So, yeah. And talking about your hardest dive, you had the highest DD out of anyone. Yeah. That's a degree of difficulty for those punches at home. <laughs> uh, out of anyone that was here, so I guess that really improved your chances uh, in the final. Oh yeah, definitely. Um, I knew that no one else had like that high degree of difficulty really and that's what I knew like if I could nail this start and do a really good get a really good score for it, I knew that I had a really good chance compared to other Yeah, people. definitely. Yeah. Well it, it certainly paid off. Yeah. I guess uh, sometimes you've got to take those risks to start values and, and the difficult uh, dives and it, it certainly paid off in your, your regards there. Alright Sam, so what's the competition like here compared to say Commonwealth Games or the Olympic Games? I guess there's a lot more people here than the Commonwealth Games. A very strong field of divers are still here, like a lot. So it's still a hard competition. Yeah, uh, former Olympians, uh, World mm. Championships athletes are here, so it is, a, it is a really high level of standard of competition. So um, I guess Sam really did a great job to win that gold. Um, another thing that we're going to talk about is the, the village here. It's one of those things that you can't really prepare for. Um, tell everyone at home what the, what the village is like. It's very big, let's just say that. There's a lot of countries, but I guess being together, everyone is still behind you. Like you feel so supported behind Australia. Even though you don't know everyone, you're just walking around like, oh, congratulations, like, well done. You just feel really welcomed and like everyone just loves each other. Like that's how it feels, and it's just huge. Yeah, 15,000 people, Jamie, is <laughs> this, uh, this area here. And yeah, we are a big Uniri family here. There's about 250 of us, yeah. so. Like Sam said, it's a, it's a good atmosphere here yeah. and, um, you know, it always helps when you win a gold medal. <laughs> um, finally, I guess, what are, what's up next for you in terms of the competition and the rest of the university at? Um, tomorrow we've got three metres springboard, so as Esther's in it as well. And then Esther and I have three metres synchro on Thursday, I think, so. So she might be taking home a few more medals, not <laughs> just this nice. one. That would be nice. That would be nice. Very good. Um, thank you very much thank for being you. on the show. Thanks for your time today. Thanks and. Um, Hopefully we get a couple more of those in the next com coming days. See you later. Bye. Thank you. Bye.